the last video i explained my drawing and inking process of a bird this video is all about painting that bird in watercolors layer by layer hi i am sneha a watercolor artist who does pet and wildlife portraits create patterns and much more i am using winsor and newton's half pan colors and before i begin i take out all the required colors from my box this avoids me getting confused between them and wrong color usage i have written a blog about what materials i usually use for my creative process you can read about it by going to my website or simply click on the link in the description below and for more such informative guides do subscribe to my channel i will quickly show you how these colors look on paper by creating this small swatches on the paper i am using burnt umber and indigo and some paints gray also i love this combination of indigo and brown just see how beautiful they look together on paper once the colors are chosen i take out my bird sketch to paint the beak i thought of using different colors than the body and what better than an ochre and orange which complements brown and indigo these two colors will be least used in the painting i will use them just to paint the beak and few feathers around it once that is done i can put them aside i start painting the beak first watercolors need time to dry on the paper so just letting it dry will just eat up my time to avoid that i start to paint other features of the bird like the eye for the eye i am using indigo color and for iris i will use paints gray and spread it with indigo to represent that small dot of a light exposure on the bird's eye I leave that space without color. For the body, I am using burnt umber. The base layer is color diluted with lot of water, and then I just dab the color to show shadows and create depth. Also, as I mentioned before, I will use orange ochre around the beak. Now, with a small brush, I will start the detailing part. the scattered feathers on on the head eyes and around the beak just building up layers upon layers and creating depth
using a technique called underpainting. This is a technique in which you build up the background layers or paint the shadow region. This highlights the light exposed parts of the subject. So this was my process, building up layer by layer for the bird. Hope you have enjoyed it. So thank you for watching. See you all in the next video.